Okay everybody, this is how you adjust the TPS on a 750 King Quad uh, or most fuel injected King Quad. This is the diagnostic port that has the black cap that goes under your seat in this little space right here. All you gotta do is find the two plugs that has the metal contact uh, in uh, that's right next to each other. The bottom one will not have uh, the metal contacts. The left one will have it, but the right one won't. So you need to stick the paper clip here in the top one. It's got both contacts on the inside. Once you do that, you will come up here to where your speedometer is, turn your turn the key on, and then you will see where it says C00. See that little line right there? That is where it needs to be in line in the middle of the COO. If it's low or high, higher than that, then you will need to adjust the TPS. Now you do that by taking out this plastic piece right here that's normally covered up. Then on the side of the intake, trying to get a better view of it, See that little thing with the ribs on it? That's your TPS. You have a bolt on the bottom and you have one on the top. And they look like they're a Phillips head on mine. It could be Allen head, could be either or. All you do is loosen those two bolts up and then adjust it just a small amount either way, up or down. And then you come back up here and look at your COO. If you got it where the line is in the middle of the C, you're good. You don't have to do anything else except for tighten the bolts back up on the TPS and then go take it for a ride. See if whatever problem you were having is better. If it's not better, probably you're going to have another issue besides the auto position sensor. So that is how, oh, and don't forget to take the paper clip out and put your black cap back on that connector. That way you don't have to worry about water or anything else getting into it. But um, that's how you adjust the TPS on your King Quad. Good luck. See you next time.